Hey, welcome guys. Tony Porter, Dice Baseball Digest, and here we are unboxing um, a 1974 mint condition um, app of baseball. Now, it's mint with aging, right? I mean, uh, the cards have never been used. The cards are still in alphabetical order. Um, I pulled out a few uh, sets, and you can, and I kind of went through them, and you can see that uh, they're still pretty much never used, but it definitely has some wear and some yellowing and that sort of thing. Now, th these are the uh, the Herb Washington rules: one player with zero at bats in Major League history. Um, just came in as a pinch runner and uh, stole a base and sometimes was caught stealing. He stole about 26 bases, I think. And he was uh, caught about 16 times. So it was around in the 40 attempts. So he did a lot of stealing and was caught stealing a lot. Uh, and uh, he has his own page of rules. Pretty crazy. For attempt did steals of third base. Uh, there's, you know, data here for the basic game and for attempted steal of second base, uh, right-handed with uh, one fielding point, no change, right-handed with two fielding points, subtract one on his card. He's got safe second base, one to 24, safe third base, one to 17, a little bit. Uh, so he would um, either pinch run from second base, try to steal third, or pinch run from first base and try to steal second. Pretty interesting. Oakland A's uh, won it all that season against the Dodgers. So let's go through. Now, I have the uh, the additional players for this set. They're also in, in order. Um, the Athletics have Haney, Washington, Abbott and Knowles, and here are those players, Washington, Haney, uh, Abbott, and Knowles right there. And then you have the um, Oakland Athletics, and as you can see, they're in alphabetical order. Had this season been played, uh, they probably would have played the uh, World Series at some point or used the A's at some point. Um, Alu. Jesus Alu starts us off, and then we have Bando. All right, you can see that. And uh, then we got Vita Blue, who's a B. Bando was a five, so he was a top defender in 1974. You got uh, Campy Campaneris. Actually, I want to keep these in order, alphabetical order. So I'm going to just kind of spin them over that way. And uh, we got Bando, who's a five. He's got one at 66 and a five at 11. That's a home run with runners on first, runners on second, runners on first and third. So that happens a lot. That's good. If you have a five, you're going to get home runs. Vita Blue, a BYZ. So he had some control in 74. He also had some strikeout power, uh, velocity, if you will. Here's Bert Campanaris, a nine shortstop, a top fielding uh, column. One or A, whatever you want to call it. Um, and he had his 11s at 15, 11 at 25, and so on. Here's Raleigh Fingers, their closer. He is a B with an XZ, so a little bit more velocity as well to strike out some players. Uh, you've got Ray Fossey, the mule. Not a great defensive catcher at a 7. Not a great hitter either. Got some walks, but not really. Even at 13, he's got a 36. Here's Dick Green. He, he's an excellent fielding second baseman at an 8. Slow runner. Um, not a great hitter. Then you have a, another relief pitcher. I believe he's a relief pitcher, but he can also start because he doesn't have a star. And that's a lefty Hamilton with a C. Uh, not great control but not terrible control. Here you got a first baseman, Holt. He's a three, but a decent outfielder at a two. An okay first baseman, not great. Um, it's got 
really no home run power. He hit some doubles. He got a double at 66 and a double at 11. Kenny Holzman. Look at Kenny Holzman's batting card. Holy smokes. Uh, one at 11, a one at 33, a one at 66, a one at 22. He's got a six at 44, 55. This is a an impressive hitting card, Kenny Holzman, and an impressive pitcher at a B as well. So these guys have a look at Catfish Hunter at an A pitcher with a 2 and a Z. He's got his control. Did give up a lot of home runs, but that doesn't come into play here in the basic game. Uh, this is one set that I kept. I picked this up during, uh, I've had it several times, but the last time I picked it up was, I believe, during COVID. Uh, when a guy kind of gave me a whole uh, case, if you will, or a whole box filled with uh, Apple sets and seasons. I've sold a couple of them, but I kept this one. Um, Reginald Martinez Jackson, two outfielder. He's got uh, home run power. He's got a J1, so he'll be playing the whole season. He's got a 1 at 66 and a 5 at 11. He's got some stolen bases, especially at 15, and also at 25 with the runner on first. Ted Kubiak, he's uh, pretty decent at shortstop, decent at second base. Uh, okay, third base, not great, um, but uh, not not not. He's uh, he's actually a C um, column third base. I believe a four is a B and a five is an A. So not a great uh, at third at third base, but he can hold his own at second and at short. Again, not a really good hitter. Doesn't have a walk at thirteen. Paul Lindblad, look at his relief. If you use him as a reliever, he's an A. If you, lose him, if you use him as a starter, he's a C. Angel Mangual, uh, Puerto Rican player. Uh, not a great uh, on-base guy either. Um, but he can play out. He can play infield. Bill North was uh, at 11-15, 11-25. And, and those are like automatic hits. Then he's got zeros at 66-33 and 11. Not uh, too many home runs. But he's got some triples. Uh, Blue Moon Odom, another guy who can uh, start and relieve. Struggles with his control. He's got a W on his card. And uh, one of my favorite players, Joe Rudy, the left fielder, also the first baseman. Uh, out of three, with a one at 66 and a four at 11. A four, I believe, is a home run with first and second, I believe. And then you got the six at 33 and at 22, so he hit some doubles. He also probably had some triples because that four. Uh, but he's got the one at 66, so he'll hit about 20 home runs. At least you can expect that on a whole season J.O., so he probably played in the upper 150 games. So is Gene Tennis. Gene Tennis, interesting guy who can play catcher, first base, uh, had good power, good on-base percentage. He's got 14s at uh, 31, 51, 14 at 61. He's got a 42. He gets hit by a pitch, and he's got that little... 42, and then explains at the bottom, 42 is a hit by pitch. That was uh, um, an addition that they created to deal with the hit by pitches for guys that got hit a lot. And then you have Claudel Washington. So you have uh, Herb Washington and Claudel Washington. But Claudel Washington, not a great outfielder, but he's got some speed, and uh, he can steal some bases. Not a terrible batting average. He's uh, got an 8 at 51, and he's got the 9 at 35. So he probably hit close to 300, maybe 280 or above. So these are back in their envelope. And uh, again, the extra players, Abbott, Glenn Abbott, and Daryl Knowles, and Larry Haney, and the Herb Washington pinch runner. That's all he could do. Why he has a 1 at 66 and a... 2 at 11 and a 3 at 33, and uh, that's pretty funny. I never noticed that. Check this out. He's got a 1 at 66, a 2 at 11, a 3 at 33, a 4 at 22, a 5 at 44, a 6 at 55, a 7 at 51, an 8 at 31, a 9 at 35, a 10 at 25, an 11 at 15, and a 12 at 21. 
<laughs> and the guy never bat in his career. That's pretty funny. He six one. They have him listed as six one on Baseball Reference. They have him listed as six zero uh, and one seventy pounds. That's correct. Bats and throws. He never played the field either. Never batted. Never played the field. And you have special rules right here. I've saved that. Uh, I should post that on uh, Universal Baseball Association. Just make a copy of this and just post it because it's getting pretty beat up, pretty torn up. So, yeah, those are the Oakland A's. Um, remember to like and subscribe to my channel. I will continue. I'm going to do uh, one at a time. For those, there's a poll going around uh, on APA forums on Facebook and also Tabletop uh, Baseball on uh, Delphi. Also, uh, Universal Baseball Association has the poll as well. It's connected to several different uh, sites. And um, check it out. Here's the original 1975. The, I almost tore it. Um, Let's see, the A's, where are they? A's, A's, A's. North, Campaneras. So if I play with these, I'm going to definitely slide them into some sleeves. Uh, North, Campaneras, Bando, Jackson, Rudy, batting fifth. Sixth is tennis. Mongual, the DH left fielder, seventh. He kind of splits time with Claudel Washington. Then you got Fossey, uh, who splits time with tennis. Uh, you got Alou, the DH, Green, and Kubiak kind of split. At this at second base, then you have Holt is your one. This was a 20 card set. You got Hunter, Blue, Holzman, Hamilton are the four starters, and then finally you got in the bullpen. You got Fingers, Lindblad, and Odom. And uh, this is when they were still at 101 Millersville, uh, Millersville Road, Lancaster, Pennsylvania, 17604. And that's it, guys. Um, I will continue to go through those uh, teams that uh, you vote on. And thanks for watching. Tony Porter, Cards and Dice TV. Um, and uh, I'll talk to you soon. Remember to like and subscribe. Take care.